Right, it's our sight singing section now. Um, we have our books ready. And we're going to jump ahead to exercise 41. The reason being that um, exercise 40 is exactly the same as what we did last time, if you can remember that far back. It's been a while. Um, so uh, the only difference in exercise 40 is they're introducing a slur, um, which is when we sing notes um, in a more legato style rather than separate or detached. So we're gonna see some of that in exercise 41. And exercise 41 isn't too tricky, I shouldn't say. We haven't got any new notes, and we will go over the notes that we've uh, learned so far uh, before we sing this. Uh, but the other thing to notice here is a two beat rest. So we see that in um, both parts, but to begin with, we see it in part one. So we sing two, two beats on the first note, and then we rest for two beats, sing for two beats, rest for two beats, okay? And then the second part, over the page, we have those two beat rests towards the end. So we've got, we've got two beat rests, and we've also got some quavers to look out for. So we're not gonna take it too fast, all right? So we're gonna have a nice, steady beat, okay? But we'll have our metronome going for that, so that should help us. We're in 4-4 four, four time, we don't have any changes of key signature, we have only got six bars, it's really straightforward, um, but it's about counting, okay? But before we jump into it, let's have a look at our on um, the notes that we have learned already. So we're in the key of C major here, which uh, is nice and easy in terms of no sharps or flats to worry about. Um, so let's go through the, the, the notes of the tonic sulfa that we have learned already. So here is your do. Do. So that's your, that's the first note in the part one. Okay. We've also learned top do. Do. That's the first note in part two. Okay. So we start with an octave uh, gap between the two parts. Now, we, the first three notes we know, do, re, mi, and backwards, mi, re, do. So we see um, lots of do, re, do, re, do, re between, uh, in um, the first part, bar three, and in the second part, over the page, bar four. And the, 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 the uh, end of this first part ends with, Mi, re, do. Okay, obviously uh, the rhythm is different from, from what I've just done, but you can look out for that pattern there, which we know. We also have a, a fair bit of movement between so and me. So, do, re, mi, so, mi, so, mi, so, mi. Okay, so we've done that a, a whole bunch of times. So, mi, do, mi, so, mi, do. That's your... Um, major arpeggio in this key okay and we have um whenever you see basically the notes g to e or or or, or, or uh, e to g that's that's your so me or me so okay and then the, the other note that we're looking out for which is the the newest tone that we've learned is la and that's just above so so if we're saying so la so Remember, it's that kind of floppy wrist is the la. So, la, so. It's literally just above so. And sometimes we approach it from the top do. Do, la, so. So, la, do, la, so. So that's the relationship between those three notes. Okay. Let's have a go at sight singing part one with... Um, the metronome, nice steady beat. Okay, here we go. Okay, so we've got our metronome going. Be ready for the page turn, okay? Ready? There's your do. One, two, three, four.
Okay, so it suddenly kind of gets a little bit quicker as you turn that page, so you have to be ready for it. Okay, let's try and sing it now anyway, okay? Mm, there's your toe. One, two, three, four. Do, 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 re, do, re, so me. How did you do? Let's have a look now at the second line. Okay, so just to sing it together, remember we're starting with top do, but I'm only going to give, I'm going to give you do. You're going to have to pitch this one. Okay, let's see how you do. One, two, three, four. Okay, when those quavers come along, it does make it a little bit trickier, doesn't it? Okay, so let's try it steady together, okay? Starting from the top. Your page turn isn't quite so tricky in the second, well, and when you get to the second part, because you're slowing down, so you have to just be sure you know what you're doing at the end of the first line, okay? Mm, there's your door. One, two, Three, four. Do la la so mi mi. Do la so la so mi. Do re do re. So la so mi so mi. Okay. <laughs> Quite tricky, isn't it? Suddenly you have to think fast. Go over it a few times. I know you will. So let's just jump straight into singing it through together. So you're going to start with part one and I'll sing part two and then we'll do what we normally do and swap right over. So here is your do. Do. One, two, three, go. So Today. So that was just a nice short little uh, sight singing exercise but you know you might feel you need to go over one or two bits there a couple of times because when we have those quavers and you have to sort of think quite quickly it helps to just kind of refresh your mind as to what, what's happening there with the notes. So we'll move on to the next um, we'll move on to the next one next time. Okay so what, what I would like you to do now is get your music for Bridge Over Troubled Water to sing through the whole thing in, in your part.